Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve you coming across an error message on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer that there was an error writing a temporary file. Make sure your temp folder is valid. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to actually just restart your computer and see if that resolves the problem, as well as relaunching the installer. You may want to try to download the installer again and then try it one more time and see if that resolves the problem. Could be an issue with a corrupt installer. Something else we can try here as well it would be to clear out our temporary files on our computer. So if you open up the search menu, type in percent sign temp percent sign. Go ahead and open up that file folder that appears. And then you can tap the Control A key on your keyboard to highlight over all the folders that appear in this list. And then right click and then select the trash bin icon to delete. You can check mark do this for all current items and select continue. If there are any items that cannot be deleted, that's okay. Just select do this for all current items and skip. That just means some files might currently be in use by your system, hence why they're unable to be deleted. So that's something to look at first. And now I want you guys to open up the search menu and search for services. Best match, should come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. You want to locate the Windows Insider service. And double click on it. You want to set startup type to manual. And then if service status is stopped, you want to start it. Stop it. And then start it one more time. And at this point, one final thing we can try as well, if you open up the search menu and type in CMD, best match, should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And then into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC, followed by a space, forward slash, scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Once that is concluded, close out of here, and you want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this pointer issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.